up to the end. Look at the thickness of the turf. And it was full of the sand up to the top. And you can't see you, and you can't feel the turf. Just you feeling the hard green surface. If we're adding the sand on top of the artificial grass, it's some just for make it heavy and sitting in the side and not moving, not too much to fill up up to the end. So this side is same as the other, we replace the edge and also we replaced on the artificial turf and with the shock pad under. This one has a shock pad already. We're taking off and we're changing by the new turf. This, see how it's, uh, what I'm talking about. It's full of sand. And need to be have some on top less like this not that much okay guys this is finished end of the day we take off the of turf and sheets of this part leave it for the excavating We're packing up the tools closing the fence and also let's take a picture of it or wider then we're going to the other side we're waiting for the bin a skip bin I mean to coming
after fixing pipes and compacting road base, we lay the Newcastle sand on top of the drained channel line to filter the soil and then we lay underlay and level it. So guys, after four days, the concrete base done, it's set for the playground and then I need to make a screws and bolt it to the concrete. I used 12 millimeter long one and the supplier sent me the small um, bolt. I think it's not strong enough to hold it. I change it and I buy the long one. That's 15 uh, milli uh, 15 centimeter long and 12 millimeter wide to hold the so now I need to make a hole by the machinery drill bit 12 millimeter going through when I did it first, I put the pin there to make it easier and to find where we need to uh, make a hole. Then I'll check it again and I level it, check the level, it was good. Now I'm making the holes by the drain. Guys, we start to laying the rubber on the on top of the road base and leveling, cut around the post somewhere, and then continuing to there. So, guys, today we are starting cutting the artificial turf and then lay it. I use the two cut for the side and the main role in the middle side because the playground it's more will be in touch in the front front of the swing and i want to lay one layer there and two cut in the side and we're using the right side of the cutting to matching to main one It's a big and very heavy one roll is more than 250 looks like it's too heavy to move it in just we need to cut inside this is a 35 millimeter turf and it's compressed we need to put the sand and take it off to be a stand up so guys, to joining to roll off the turf, we cut one line of that, and then that's going that side, and the other one going this side. One one line from this part, and three line from the other to match the corners, the joints. Then we're cutting three line from the other side. I wanna match this one to the pole. And the other one coming through. I'm gonna put one layer here and then I cut for these two parts and push it there. Cause I don't give a fuck what you say. Yeah, I'ma do shit my way. So you can go kick rocks, I'ma stack bricks up, build what I want to make. Yo! 
I got a lot of shit to say, so I'ma do this every day. I'll be writing things until I'm fucking buried in my grave. Six feet deep under, but my body won't decay. Cause my messages are kinda so they'll put them on display. Oh yeah, I rap with a certainty. I have a sense of urgency. A message for eternity for everyone internally. I had some people burning me, but now they fucking learn to see. I ain't the one to fuck with. Now they looking nervously, and I don't really care what you think of me respectfully. You can kick rocks if you think you're fucking better. See, I will let my way so you can go kick rocks i'ma stack bricks up build what i want to make cause i don't give a fuck what you say yeah i'ma do shit my way so you can go kick rocks i'ma stack bricks up build what i want to make yeah i'ma do it my way good morning guys we're coming to the job um, in the morning I want to level the pit by the grass it's too low I need to rise it up by the mortar and also we use the same brick edge we did it for the artificial turf around the playground and I made a formwork there by the timber and then we have an angle um, steel in the side galvanized and then I will lay the brick around it. When we touching the top of the formwork, I install the anger steels in two sides as well, this side and the other side, and then laying back the cap, then I will make a brick edge around it. So guys, this is a finish. I put the angles and then the cap on top, then make a brick edge around it. 600 by 600 um, drain pit, a storm water pit actually. So guys, job completed, we are taking the fence and watering the grasses, everything's ready for kids to play and enjoy the play new playground. That's the edge. Rain and channels, stormwater pit. And also the other one is completed as well. It's done.